Hello, my name is Chris, and today we're going to take a quick look at how to display data with a box and whisker plot in Microsoft Excel. First, select the category labels and the numbers in your data set. Then go to the Insert tab on the menu bar and then click on the Statistical Charts icon. A drop down menu will appear and choose the box and whisker chart. And just like that, Excel creates a box and whisker chart for you. But there's quite a bit of formatting that needs to be done to help people focus on the most important information. First, I will click and drag on the corner of the chart to make it larger so it's easier to work with. Next, I'll add the title for the box and whisker chart by simply copying and pasting the title from the spreadsheet. One thing I'm not too keen on is this large amount of white space on either side of the box and whisker plots. It makes it more difficult to interpret the data. So I'm going to double click on the X axis, which will open up the formatting panel. Here, I'm going to go to the axis options and change the gap width from one to zero. Now that looks a lot better with the box and whisker chart plots evenly spaced out. Next, I'll click on the X axis label and delete it since it provides no useful information. But what I need is a legend so that people can understand which box and whisker plot represents which playoff team. I'll click on the add chart element icon and then choose legend where I will put it at the bottom. Now we've successfully created a box and whisker chart that helps people understand the range of salaries paid on playoff sports teams which in turn will help general managers, for example, make data-driven decisions. 